beautiful, beautiful, beautiful truck. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel, y'all. We over here at Quick Trip. We are in Kansas. A little dusty. I've been sitting all day. Finally got me some little rest, y'all. Uh, I am going over here to Cold Point to pick up a load. And uh, I am taking this down to, I believe it's, actually I think it's before Springfield, Illinois. So they want at least three-fourths reefer fuel. So I got about a half. Hopefully, the $50 that I'm putting on here will work. If not, I hope it do, man. These people over here, they they real strict, y'all, with the amount of reefer fuel you need to have inside your reefer in order to haul they load. So if you got at least three fourths, then you're good to go. So hopefully 50 will do me pretty good. And uh, once we uh, once we get over here, we gotta drop the trailer. So we're gonna drop the trailer. And uh, once I do that, I'm gonna take advantage of that. Clean the rear deck plate, get everything. It's a little dusty. Oh, she's still, she's still right, y'all. Just dusty, you know. My truck get real dusty after it sit for a while, so we're gonna clean everything up, get this fuel, probably go on a quick trip, and uh, probably grab something off the menu. They actually be having some good food at quick trips with the Q. The K up there in Wisconsin, I'll be getting me some uh, a cheese pizza, and they make that fresh, so. Man, I'm hoping this thing give me what I need, man. Please. But we're gonna fuel this reefer up, then we're gonna get inside a quick trip, order some food, then get over here to Cold Point, which is right down the road. Diesel over here is 355. And uh, we're gonna be rolling out tonight, y'all. Getting as close as we can. We got to deliver to McLean. Crazy McLean down there, and the reviews are not good, and I'm not looking forward to it, but hopefully we have some good luck. So let's get this reefer fuel, and then we're gonna get up out of here, y'all. Believe it or not, y'all. That's not what it did. 50, $50 didn't do that. I was probably right above three fourths and I knew that it was gonna be petty. So just used my credit card and uh, it came out to $50.97. And then I did another and that came out to $50.91. So we spent $100 on reefer fuel. And uh, right now I'm about to go on a pre-trip while I go in here and try to grab me something to eat. Lock this door up. Yep, so we're gonna run a pre-trip while we in the yeah, ain't nobody in line anyway. As far as anything, so we good. Let's get on in here and try to see if we can find us something good to eat or something fresh. I might just get a grilled cheese sandwich, something simple. I don't know. Nice pea right there. Pizzas, breakfast, lunch, dinner. Let me see what they got. Flat bridge. That's all they got. Cheese look good. Cheese, 
same route now. Nah. Ten ninety nine ain't bad, but I don't want to take a risk, man. All right, y'all. The cheese pizza look decent, man. Pick girl up. Let's go pick up. See what this pre trip done did. Y'all, we love it. Still got about love, man. We'll let that do what it do. I'm gonna eat this pizza and then we'll get up out of here, y'all. We still got about 45 minutes till our pickup time. right over there and uh, we just put it right here wipe her down and uh, wait for them to call us that's what we're gonna do it's a little bit too dark y'all so I'm uh I'm definitely about to wipe her down I'm about to put some tire shine on now the wind not blowing it's the perfect time to do it so let's get busy oh my god oh my come on man Man, y'all need to put me in the Hall of Fame for this. I need to be doing this as a profession. I need to open up my own little wash bay. Now, the only thing I can't get y'all is I can't get my top cap 
on both sides and at the top, my top stacks. But we definitely gonna invest into a, a ladder for sure. Come on, y'all. We ready for that night flight. Woo -hoo -hoo. You think I'll be going to mats right now, how clean I am. Man. Come on, y'all. I do this. I can't name nobody. I can't name nobody better. That's an owner operator and keep his truck this clean all the time. I'm like this all the time. 95% of the time when you catch me, I'm gonna be clean. Now, if some weather come through, that's just what it is. But 95% of the time, I'm clean, y'all. Come on, man, let's go get this trailer. Separate myself, you guys. I keep my truck clean just as much. I, you know, I take that serious just like I take my my maintenance serious. So, y'all see this whole bottom row just out? <laughs> oh, none of them work. But I still got my factories working and the top up there is working. So we two weeks away from being at the house. We about to get all this stuff fixed. So that way when we come back out, we're gonna be shining bright like a diamond, y'all. I'm actually about to remove those caps and I'm about to stop running the actual cap and just run the actual lug nut covers. So that way I can get a good look at always at my, at my hub oil, so. Let's go into this, uh, this place and uh, let's go get our paperwork. All right, y'all, time to roll, woo -hoo. That girl, that's a bad girl right there, buddy. That's a bad girl right there, buddy. Ooh, wee, wee. Ooh, wee. Y'all ready for flight? Is y'all ready for that flight? I don't think y'all ready for that flight, y'all. Two more weeks, y'all. Two more weeks. We finish our two month. Let's get on this road, y'all. We got 190 miles, gonna go ahead and knock out all of it. And then uh, we got 11.30 a.m. appointment tomorrow. And then we dead back to Indiana, y'all. Let's get this money. Load it up. Slide these tandems back. Slide them back up. Then we're gonna get rolling. Got that audit done. Sent all the paperwork in today. So, just waiting to hear it back now. Let's check this seal. All right, 846. We ready for flight. Gonna go ahead and knock out as many, as many miles as possible. 
probably find us a little truck stop or somewhere to stay tonight. They ain't got overnight parking at no McLean, so. And this one is at, uh, I believe it's at 35 degrees. Probably get a little bit of fuel down there in Mount Vernon, Missouri tomorrow at the TA. Get some fuel down there once we empty out before we hop on 44 and get through St. Louis and then hop on 70 to get all the way to Indianapolis. Appreciate it, brother. Hold up. Don't go nowhere. All right. Gotta check the seal now. We up out of here. Twenty two hundred pounds. Twenty two hundred pounds, that's it. You actually ain't even got no load on for real. Twenty two hundred pounds. gallon. Coming 
over here to this to this truck stop just to see if I can position myself in a nice little spot. Nothing I ain't got a bag into. Okay, AM, AM Bass. I'd have been to plenty of AM Bass. I just need a nice little spot to position myself. That's all, nothing major. Anywhere with a red as the fire line <laughs> is everywhere. There's a spot right there. Should have came in the other way. So I need somewhere to park. Ain't nowhere to park in that area. So I'll put it right here to the morning. Perfect, y'all. 
we are perfect. That's what I'm talking about. Put this lock on. Come on now. That tire shine on tomorrow for today. Yeah, we look good. people that go to bed with their lights on man that's that gotta be some of the craziest stuff you can do just go to bed with your lights on man <laughs> all right y'all so uh actually got a video oh okay we up and running yeah! Gotta connect my, my phone. Oh man, we good. So I got a video that I'm about to upload. So I was letting it load. Letting it load while I was uh driving, so. But I will get with y'all in the morning, y'all. See y'all in the morning. Probably wipe down a little bit more. Take care of a few things. And uh, we get over here to McLean and then uh, start making our way to Indiana, y'all. Get this deadhead out the way. Uh, it's time to go grind. Got a few hours of sleep. About to check over this truck. We about to get moving. We got a long day ahead of us. Got to drop this off. Then we got to shoot over the Indiana make picks tomorrow, so I needed that little when I got done at I forgot when I got done. But I needed that few hours of sleep though for sure. It's been a few days since I had some sleep. <clears throat> Let's check over this truck and uh hopefully McClain can get me off real quick, man. I'm not trying to be there all day. We got uh, about 400 some miles of dead head back. So let's check over this truck, y'all. Oh, man. Good morning, my neighbors! Shut up! Throw some more shine on. We're gonna throw that shine on these trailer tires today. As soon as I get down there. Nice low open field. I think we're going south. Yeah, we're going south. Had a bomb sleeping next to me last night. Try Freddy's steak burgers. I never tried it. 
How that taste? Put it down in the comments. Steak, steak burger shakes, frozen custard. It's a beautiful day in old Missouri. Yes, it is. Checking a ride out. I see you checking a ride out, brother. Ain't nothing wrong with it. We gonna put her in four. Yes, yeah, sir. Let's get this day started, y'all. Another day, another dollar. Just pulled up the McLean, and this look like the McLean I be going to up there in Finley, Ohio. You know what? I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight trucks. That ain't so bad. Let's go check in. Man, I hope I get out of here in a decent time. We're gonna go ahead and wipe down a little bit more. Get her ready for flight to hop on 44. Then we're going to go back to our little spot to get some fuel, uh, fill her up, and uh, get on back to Indiana. Stop at our little stop and uh, admire. Uh, get up in the morning and get back to it. We got two more weeks, y'all. Two more weeks out. Man, I only got three, four pallets, so hopefully I can get off quick. My appointment at 11. I'm an hour early. So, oh, man. Nice little long line, man, that we got going on. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it's nine trucks. I walk up here. So let's get up here, y'all. All right, y'all. They just called us. Told us to drive up to the guard shack. Let's see what they going to say now. What door they going to give me. check or a com check from ch robinson man you oh man i gotta do that you gotta jump through hula hoops just to get it man it's ridiculous please don't touch please don't touch oh please don't touch all right man you gotta jump through hula hoops just to get it y'all it's crazy there you go Appreciate it, man. So you don't need to see the back. Oh yeah, just rubbing the pallet. Ah oh, man. Clean 
envíos Got your phone on, you can take a picture of it. That way I can get my... Appreciate it, brother. All right. All right, y'all. Uh, let's get our butts east. And uh, at the fuel, if the fuel is cheap enough over here, I'm going to see what is, because fuel is actually supposed to be going down. So. He's still here. Man. I'm going to see what the fuel is over there in my area. See what the price difference is. The price difference. And, uh, hold on. Hold on. Alright y'all, we stopped at our little spot. About to go ahead and get fuel over here. Man, going back east towards Illinois and Ohio. Man, fuel is up. So I'm getting it for I believe this 349, if I'm not mistaken. Let me slow it down a little bit. caked up on there. All right, y'all, let's get on to it. Still got about 300 more miles. Got to get through St. Louis. We fueled up. And uh, I ain't gonna lie, y'all, I really want to get to some cooler weather. Just cuz. I ain't trying to mess with no bugs. Ooh. I ain't trying to mess with no bugs. Let's get up out of here, y'all. I'll see y'all in St. Louis.
right, y'all. We made it over here to our spot at the Mire. And uh, chilling right up under the lights tonight. Cut the reef on in the morning. We got three pickups. We'll get to the docks. We don't need a wash. Uh, but when I do get to the docks, I'm going to detail a little bit more. Maybe put a little bit of polish, but nothing major. I'm good to go. Last week wash has pushed me all the way to this week. No rain, so that means I ain't got to spend no money. But probably get a little bit more detail with our wipe down. Got the grill surround just wiped down in the stacks. Got them wiped down as far as the bugs and stuff. Bumper and everything like that. Got all that taken care of. So that way I ain't got to deal with that. But once it warm up tomorrow, I get the body of the truck and all that tomorrow. So we're going to get some shut eye and uh, relax. And uh, I will see y'all in the morning, y'all. She's looking good up under that light.